The Bulgars border the lands of the Birders. They are camped on the bank of a river that flows into the Khazar Sea and is called the Volga. They live between the Khazars and the Sakaliba. Their ruler, called Almish, is a Muslim. The region is marshy and thickly forested, in the middle of which camps the population. They are composed of three hordes, the Barsula, the Ishgil and the Bulgars, all living together in one place. They trade with the Khazars and the Rus, who bring their merchandise to them. The Bulgars, who live on both banks of the Volga, offer various products in exchange, such as the pelts of sable, ermine and grey squirrel, and other furs. They are an agricultural people who grow all sorts of grain, wheat, barley and millet. The majority are Muslim, and there are mosques and Quran schools in their inhabited places. They have muezzins and imams. The infidels have the custom of prostrating themselves when they meet their friends. These Bulgars are camped three days march from the Birders, whom they raid frequently and bring back as captives. They have horses and coats of mail and their arms are superb. They pay tribute to their ruler in the form of horses and the like. When a man marries, the king takes a horse. When Muslim ships come to them, a tax of 10% is levied on the merchandise. They dress like the Muslims, and their tombs are constructed like those of the Muslims. Their wealth consists above all of marten pelts. They don't use hard cash, since their unit of exchange is the marten pelt, which is worth two and a half dirhams. Sometimes they use round silver dirhams, which they receive from Muslim lands, in exchange for their wares. Then they in turn use those dirhams to pay the Rus and Sakaliba, for these peoples will only sell their goods for hard cash. <laughs>